bless you for coming. <laughs> Intelligence Squared is primarily known as a public policy debate series, so I'd like to start the evening by sharing with you the reasons we wanted to do a debate about religion. America has always incorporated uh, complex ideas about religion in its political culture. Creationism is invoked in the most famous words of our founding document. We hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal, that they are endowed by their creator with certain inalienable rights. The First Amendment to the Constitution begins with the ringing words, Congress shall make no law respecting an establishment of religion. But note these words do not banish religion from the public square. Indeed, many of the original 13 colonies had official state religions, which the amendment protects from the actions of Congress. Nor is there any constitutional issue when the president, in his role as commander in chief, hires ministers and rabbis and priests to perform religious duties as members of the armed forces. Tonight's debate should prove equally complex. Proponents of the motion might cite the violence perpetrated in the name of religion, while opponents will counter that most warfare throughout history was totally or primarily about uh, territory and economic advantage. Proponents might cite the absence of proof for central religious beliefs, indeed the repugnance of some of them, while opponents emphasize the utility of faith and ritual in helping believers cope with the challenges of life. But both sides are likely to concur that every well-ordered society needs some key moral principles and that every thoughtful person needs a sense of meaning and purpose in life. The key question for tonight's debate, the complex question, is whether those central needs can be better met in a world with or without religion. We have a very uh, outstanding panelist uh, group tonight with us, and it's my privilege at this point to turn the evening back to John Donman and to our great panel. Thank you. Thank you.